Hello everyone and welcome to another Ragnarok Tips and Tricks video. Today we will take a look at another way to augment our raw zeni farming. So these are little improvements that will help maximize the time spent while farming. So these might not give us millions or billions of zeni but it will still uh, add a significant uh, amount of zeni in the long term. So the card we will be looking at today is the Anopheles card. As you can see it adds a chance of dropping tentacle cheese gratin while killing insect monsters. So it's a card that you slot into your accessory. So per character you can uh, conceivably uh, wear two of these types of cards in two different accessories. So this is what the photo looks like for some reason. It's also called a wires, wires, I don't know. All right, so let's take a look at the more info on this card, Anopheles card. The most important thing to take a look at here is this item script and at the end it says 50. So roughly that means that this card gives you half a percent chance to drop that item. So what you do is you multiply it by your server rate. So for my server, it was 20 because uh, uh, Shining Moon has 20% increased drop rate. So I have a 10% chance to drop the item. Now on another server, for example, let's say your server drop rate is at 10%. Your chance to get the tentacle and cheese gratin is 5%. So let's take a look at my details here. So I'm wearing one accessory with the card and then these is two accessories with the card. So from 10% to 20%. So the next question is, where do you farm with this? So remember, it says that you need to kill insect monsters. So since the item that this card drops is not the main source uh, of income for your farming run it's just an augmentation or just a bonus so to speak so you have to choose mobs that uh, there's already a drop that you're particularly aiming for in that mob and then the Anopheles card will just give you a bonus so for example in pre-renewal or in low rate servers where in uh, Eluniums are still a, a pricey item you could for example hunt these Argiopes while wearing the Anopheles card accessories and it will give you a bonus. So your main focus is farming for rough Eluniums but you'll be getting the bonus dro uh, drop item which is the uh, tentacle and cheese gratin. Uh, the Argos are also insects so uh, they will also be able to proc this drop chance. So yeah, that's uh, that's what I meant about it's an augmentation to your farming. Another location for pre-renewal or low rate servers is when you're hunting for uh, what to call these? What are these branches? Dr dead branches or honey from the uh, enchanted peach trees. Now the bloody but butterflies, which are also in the same map, are insect and they're uh, what's the term I'm looking for? They are... Uh, I forgot. They will basically attack you at any time if they you go into their... Uh, uh, they're aggressive, that's the term I'm looking for. They're aggressive, so they will attack you when they see you. So if you're still going to have to kill them, uh, why not add a, an item that increases the possibility of getting something valuable from them considered, considering that the drops from the bloody butterflies themselves aren't that particularly valuable. So that's another uh, option wherein you can farm and use the Anopheles card as um, augmentation. Now, for renewal servers or mid-rate servers like the server I'm playing in, which is Shining Moon, um, a lot of those types of servers, one of the places wherein you you level up uh, by doing repeatable quests will be in the Scaraba dungeon. So everything inside the Scaraba dungeon, as you can see here, are all considered insect-type monsters, even the eggs. So every single mob in this dungeon will proc the chance of dropping the 
tentacle and cheese gratin. So that's uh, that's pretty nifty. So while you're hard at work trying to reach the maximum level cap, you're also uh, farming a little bit more zeny than usual. So let's take a look at the item itself. There we go. That's the item you're getting from equipping the Anopheles card. So it's a cooked food. It has Agi plus 3, minor HP and SP increase. So depending on your server, you could sell that if uh, buff foods are not a normal thing. You could sell it to players, but uh, for most other servers like mine, you just sell it as raw zeni. And of course, if you sell it with your merchant with overcharge, it also extends the, the or increases the amount of zeni you can earn. So yeah, uh, you saw earlier it was 3,000 zeni per item. All right, there you have it, folks. Uh, just a quick video to give you an idea uh, about tips and tricks on how to improve your uh, your farming. I hope you enjoyed the video and were able to gain some ideas and insights for your next farming session. Uh, please like the video and subscribe to the channel for more Ragnarok tips and tricks. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.